Out in Howell, robotics is all the rage. Between our two middle schools, 75 students interested in joining the team. There's something about STEM that has that cool factor. Just ask the FTC team CRASH, that stands for Kids Robotics and Science of Howell. I love the engineering that goes into it and the um, friends it helps you make. Sure, the kids learn how to design, build, and operate robots, but team CRASH mentor April Vanderplas says there's so much more to it. These kids are learning how to be part of a team how to work through problems as a team, problem solving, you know, from an engineering standpoint. And then they're also learning speaking skills. And marketing skills. In FIRST Robotics, we're all about spreading the word of FIRST. Enter the Crash Team STEM Box in downtown Howell. It's a twist on a classic community-focused project. So it came from the little free libraries that we often see on the side of the road, um, and just wanting to get people involved in FIRST and learning about STEM. Inside, free STEM kits geared toward elementary school students. Each kit contains like simple materials to create um, the STEM kit, and it helps you like learn more about that. The team's been switching them out every few weeks. This next kit? We decided we needed a Christmas-themed STEM kit. Is your goal to stick toothpicks and um, gumdrops together so to make the tallest shelf and then set your elf on the top to make sure it stays stable. And Crash isn't just stopping at the local level, they're spreading the word on their Instagram page and... We've reached out to international teams um, to um, invite them to make their own STEM boxes and place them out in their community. Spreading the word about FIRST to our community is definitely one of our biggest goals. Um, we want to let people know about robotics and all the career fields that can help you in. The STEM box isn't going anywhere anytime soon, so grab your kid, grab a kit, and let the magic happen. In downtown Howell, I'm Alexandra Bahu, STEM in Action News.